Hey guys, hope everybody's having a fantastic day today. I wanted to talk about a budget or very value conscious bud, uh, button lock that came into the market about four or five months ago and I added it to my collection. It is the Civivi Cogent. I probably mispronounced that, but the Civivi Cogent is a mid, um, almost on the size of a larger knife. Um, I would say it's a good medium sized knife. I've got a medium large hand and you can see that my hand wraps around it pretty nicely there. I've got a full grip, full purchase on the handle. I wanna say it's around a three and a half inch blade. I'll have some specs in the description and you guys can look those up. We'll do a few size comparisons. But anyway, let's just talk about the Cogent for a sec. It's Civivi's second button lock. So they first came out with everybody's favorite, the Elementum button lock that we'd open like that. And then they went back to the drawing board and came up with some different button locks. And if I'm not mistaken, before the Atticus came out, they released the Cogent, which was a flipper deployment. So it did have a flipper instead of just the button lock to actually get that blade out. Didn't have thumb studs like the Atticus, but it is a flipper only and it does have very smooth action. Um, it's clip point blade, flipper deployment, buttery smooth, button lock action, buttons right here and it's recessed down into the G10 handle so you're not gonna accidentally activate it. But the Civivi Cogent, again, being a medium to a little bit larger than medium size knife, let's go in and let's do a couple of quick size comparisons and see how it um, compares to some of these other knives. It's, uh, again, G10, and then it's treated um, blackened out blade that's 14C 28N. Let's see here. Let's compare it to the Cold Steel Formax. And as you can tell, it is much smaller than the Cold Steel Formax. Sorry about that pause. I had a whiny ass cat I had to let out the door. And now let's look at it next to the Civivi Baby Banter. It's a good bit larger than the Baby Banter. No surprise to anybody. Let's see how it compares to the Benchmade Bug Out, which I think most of us have an idea of the size of the Benchmade Bug Out. I'm gonna come in smaller than the Benchmade Bug Out, a little bit smaller handle and smaller blade. And let's look at it next to the Spyderco Paramilitary 2. And guys, it's a little smaller than the Paramilitary 2, and the handle probably has a little bit larger blade than the Paramilitary 2, at least larger cutting area. But it's going to fall in between the size of that um, bug out and the Spyderco Paramilitary 2. What do I think about the Cogent? I think for a budget knife, for a button lock, it's probably the Civivi that's gotten the most of my button lock attention. I love the little Atticus, but for a knife that has a really tall, flat grind, comes down to a very keen edge, has a pointy clip point tip, can really fill my whole hand, has some actionable jimping at the top of the spine. I think this knife suits me a little bit more than the Atticus in terms of a a favorite Civivi button lock. One negative I will give this knife is the pocket clip is deep carry. It carries fine, goes in and out of pocket fine, but because the knife's a little bit on the thinner side, it does give you a good bit of a hot spot after a while. So if you were going to process cardboard, which this knife would be perfect for because of the blade design and geometry, um, you're going to feel that pocket clip. But it's nothing that's a deal breaker. And again, I think the Civivi Cogent is a great knife. Um, I can't remember. I want to say it comes in around the $70 mark. Um, you can find it in Amazon or all of our favorite blade retailers. Most importantly, guys, my screen's been out of center, which it always is. It's either going to be out of center at the top or at the bottom. Drives me personally batshit crazy, but I hope it doesn't bother you guys. I do hope that you look out for the guy or girl to your left. 
I hope you look out for the guy or girl to your right. I hope you guys are kind to each other. I hope I see you all in a lot of chats. Um, I know we're going to disagree. It happens from time to time. Just always talk out your differences. Don't be quick to cast judgment. Move forward with debate, not hate. I love you all. Thanks for watching the video. Peace.